had to have been months ago, if not close to two months ago. I mean, it's been a long fucking time. When I told you guys about that girl that bought the bra off of me on Depop and then USPS tried to charge her like $23 or something like that to complete the delivery. And uh, they just like left a note at her door and she was like, okay, come back and I'll do it. And then they never came back. She and I have been keeping contact on and off. She's like, did they ever send it back to you? And I was like, no, and you never got it. And she's like, no, I have a theory that that bra, that package is going to end up in one of those lost mail stores. Someone's going to end up with a Killstar sports bra. <laughs> I mean, it's funny, but it's not funny. Uh, I get like the girl got a refund, but I was once I got it back, I was going to send it. Usually what happens if you don't pick up your mail? It gets returned to the sender. What was going to happen was once it got to me in the mail, I was going to send it back to her. It's The bitch is just gone. It's just gone. It probably already is in one of those stores in Pennsylvania. It's shitty, but like, how fucking wild. I took off right out of my house without something to vlog with. So, you all get the busted mic. <laughs> Sorry. That's the second time I've done that recently. I think I was like worried about being late. I was honestly so focused on finding my sunglasses that I also left behind. I am starving and I have had absolutely no caffeine. I love life today. It's the, it's the best, the greatest. I just had to double check that I even have my wallet. Sure would be a shame if I came all the way here and didn't even have fucking have any money to go in and buy a drink. I almost just started having a, a, a damn panic attack because I was like, oh no, where's my phone? You're vlogging on it. Did you see that? It felt kind of weird to go into a CVS just to get snacks because I, I <laughs> can't do it. I can't go into like a different store. I'm burning the fuck up. It's like 80 some odd degrees and I have the windows up so I can vlog. There is a man driving his bike, riding his bike around in circles in heavy traffic on a part of the street that I have to drive down. So I'm just going to sit here and eat and hope that he gets over it and moves the hell on before I have to go that way because I will have a fucking mental breakdown. I think I took a nap. I'm not sure. I did the like half sleep thing, you know what I mean? Like I, I kind of think I might have not really sure that I did. My little desk that I set up is already getting out of control. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Today is my kid's last day of school and it feels like Friday because of that. And it's actually Wednesday and it's like really fucking with me. Cause I was like, oh, I'm going to go tomorrow cause it's the weekend and get some lights for behind me because the background's really boring, you know? And then I'm like, Hooker, it's, it's the middle of the week. What the hell are you talking about? And then I realized it, it just feels like Friday because it's spring, or it's spring? Summer break starts today, officially. After school starts, they're off of school for four, for three months. Um, I put lights in my pumpkin. 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 <laughs> I put batteries in my pumpkin for the first time in probably a year. Wow, it looks green. It doesn't look orange at all. Uh, I actually have two of these and it's funny because I didn't realize it. It's funny because I didn't know. I didn't know I had two. I don't know when or where or why or how I got two, but I have two. Um, one has an adapter and the other one doesn't. Guess what? I lost the adapter for the other one. So. <laughs> yeah, Therese, it is. I like how I'm talking so seriously and I got these gross fucking eyebrows on. I like took half a nap and I lost them and now I lost them all the way because I just wipe them off my greasy fucking face. <laughs> I'm also trying to salvage this wig. 
just to save $50. I mean, $50 is a whole fucking afterpay payment, you know? It's a whole afterpay payment. I'm just, I'm just trying to salvage for a few more weeks. Just a few more weeks. Uh, maybe I should, I, it doesn't need cut quite yet. I did put heat on it and it helped it a lot. But when it does need cut, we're gonna do it right. And not hack it off and make it look like a bad Coraline wig. We'll do it slowly. Slowly, a little bit at a time to, to salvage the length for as long as possible. Do I have a fucking hair in my eye? The entire point of me sitting here and pinning back my bangs and everything, I'm trying to think about how to go about mixing this with this. Now this brand, the LA Girl, does have neutralizers. You can buy them, they're at the store. Uh, where else would they be on the fucking moon? They, they have them at, at my CVS, but I'm not going back out. It's too fucking hot. It's too hot to sit in. I already did this morning for an appointment and then I already went to CVS, but I had my debit card on me and my debit card had $7 on it. Um, I'd have to take Epps's debit card and go back out. And it's just not something that I feel like doing. It's not something that I just, it's not on the agenda for me today. Why am I telling you all of this? I don't know. The biggest problem I'm having is like, what the fuck am I going to mix it on? And what the fuck am I going to mix it with? And also, um, I'm going to start with this as the base. Because I feel as if, if I start with this... All that's going to happen is it's just, just going to get eaten by this. Like, ah, you know, oh, I mean, ah, you know, and all this is going to do, if I put a bunch of this down and then squirt a bunch of this in, it's just going to give me like a fuck ton of foundation that I don't need. This is the logic that I have in my brain. Okay. That's what I'm telling myself. But if I start off with this and just add this. This will be adding color to this instead of this just kind of like adding girth to this. You know what I mean? But also at the same time, I'm terrified that I'm going to mix this and then not have enough to do my, my whole face. I may be overthinking, but let's be fucking for real here. Those are both realistic scenarios. But did I say both? I think I only said one thing and that's that I'm afraid I'm not going to make enough. I might have to get like a plate or something to mix it on. Also, I lost my ring. It's somewhere in my bathroom. It may be a sign that it's time to replace it. For those of you who don't know, I lost my ring, my wedding ring, um, a couple of months ago in the bathroom because it's a size eight and I lost a hundred pounds and now I'm a size six and a half. I uh, went to the pharmacy bought a silver ring i've been wearing it for months epps found my ring i put it back on i lost it within a day so i've just been wearing this silver pharmacy ring well it's tarnished and like the fake diamond in it is like super cloudy so maybe it's just time to replace it i just i can't stand not having a ring on but i thought i'd say something before someone said something but she's lost in my i know she's in the bathroom though so it's lost but it's not like lost lost this is not going to be very professional how do i mix this how do i mix it do i thought about mixing it like on top of like an eyeshadow palette rather than going downstairs and getting like a plate or something though that probably is the best option but also with a palette I can just wipe it off just as easily as I can wipe off a plate and I won't have to go downstairs to do that this really shouldn't be so difficult it really shouldn't be so difficult all right we've got our plate I literally almost fucking picked up that foundation and threw that shit down I am um, I love saying one thing and doing another this probably seems like a lot, but I have a massive fear of not having enough foundation. I would rather have too much than not enough. Uh, yeah, so let's see. I have like this little, look, it looks like white paint. And then we're gonna add a little bit of this. I Like I said, the pharmacy where I live has neutralizers, but also it's too dark for me right now. So now what the fuck am I gonna use to stir it? 
We're very professional chemists. We're very, very professional chemists. It's, it's doing something. Oh, wow, this is going to take a really fucking long time. Because of what I'm using, sister, I'm going to guess. Wow. Why did I sniff it? I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. This is what I came up with. Now, how the fuck do I test it? I think it's a little too light. I think it's a little too light. A little too light. It just needs a, li a little bit. Just a little, a little itty skitty tiny more. We'll do like two pumps. <coughs> We're four. I'm not sure this is going to do very much. I'm a chemist. Wow, it looks exactly the fucking same. Cool, we're cool. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, a hundred. Did that do anything or is she just gonna spread? Is she just getting girthy? That's my favorite thing about mixing things, is just you just end up with twelve thousand tons more than you actually need it's like making pasta all right i don't think that made any difference whatsoever i was so worried about like adding just like adding like umph to the dark foundation and now i'm just worried that we're just adding umph to the light foundation i'm fucking it up right now we're really going for it. We're really doing it. Well, if one thing's for sure, I probably won't be able to use this foundation after this. There's probably not gonna be fucking any left. All right. I actually really do like the formula of the foundation. I don't know if I told you guys that, but I actually enjoyed the formula of it. If I could find it in the, uh, like the correct shade, I would be very, very happy with it. It looks a little more golden, and that's about it. Why can't things just be easy and go my way? Why can't things just be easy like just do what i want you to do the first fucking time why can't they just do what i want them to do the first time Ooh. <laughs> all right all right all right i'm like quite literally going to use all of this foundation to just do this little experiment but I think I want to, I want to try harder to like find my shade. I do, I, I do think that I want to try a little bit harder to find my shade because I actually do like it. It's just, it's too dark and now it's too late. How the fuck, how the fuck do I get this washable thing off of my off of my face. I'm 33 and I've been wearing makeup since I was like nine. How do? We've created a monster. We've created a monster. <clears throat> After this, I give up because we've used way too much. We've used so fucking much foundation. All right, let's test it. Oh wow, it pretty much looks exactly the fucking same. I'm so shocked. 
I'm so shocked by that revelation. That's not a revelation at all. What if I give up? <sighs> like, what if I just give up? I just want to see what would happen if I just... I feel like fucking Megan Fox in Jennifer's body right now. I bet she's thick. Ah. Uh, if I could find it in my right shade, fuck yeah. What do you mean? What do you mean, hooker? What do you mean? It's got to be the clown white that's in this. It's got. It's got to be. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. She looks so good. I can't believe it. Wow. I watch a lot of things that I say and do back, and I think, it is who I am. I'm leaving it in. Um, so I went to the bathroom to wipe that off, and with a makeup cloth, by the way. Um, and, and I gotta tell you guys, I looked in the mirror. I couldn't help myself. You know, I, could, I couldn't help myself but to look in the mirror whenever I was wiping my face off. Why would I do that? Um, anyways, I fucking... The texture of this foundation, every pore and every wrinkle on this bitch's face was shining bright like a fucking diamond. Uh, crater face. I have very large pores. Very, very large pores. And girlfriend, you could count them. You could mark them. You could put those little like flags in them. Mm-hmm. All my fine lines. You know what it was giving? It was giving too much Dream Matte Mousse in junior high. That's what the texture, uh, texture of this foundation was giving. Do I want to use it? Not really like it all it grossed me out so bad I was like oh it has to be it quite literally has to be this stuff it has to be now don't get me wrong this one this foundation has like a moussey texture to it it's like liquid slash mousse it's very light but when I was in high school I would have this massive issue where uh the creases of my nose would always look gross and that has not been an issue for me for years. Well, honey, if I didn't look in the fucking mirror and get taken back to 2004. Yeah, I don't know if I can do this. Uh, because it's still early in the day and I still have things to do. And I would, I would actually have to be seen like by my husband looking like that. He'll never view me the same. He'll never view me. He'll, and he wouldn't care, but in here... He'd be like, huh? He'd probably be like, you look how you always look. <laughs> I would be like, I, I'm thinking about running to Big Lots because I want some lights for around this. And I don't want to go to Walmart. So I may actually have to get like outdoor lights instead of like cute indoor lights. Because I'm desperate to avoid Walmart. But um, I don't, I don't know if I want to, I feel like I would be so much more self-conscious than I already am. You know what I mean? I'd be like, people are looking at my fucking crater face. Instead of just looking at me for having six face tattoos, uh, they're looking at me because I, I, and the thing is with me, I love a cake face. I fucking love a cake face. I was watching TikTok one day and I came across this girl that had red hair and freckles. And she had the most blunt line of makeup where, you know, she had freckles on her face. Well, you could see that she was wearing makeup. I was like, bitch, give it to me. Mm, I love it. I fucking love heavy, heavy makeup. I love heavy makeup. I do. I don't know why. I love it. And that's too much for me. It's giving drugstore before drugstore got its shit together. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Is this me admitting that I'm already uncomfortable in public and I don't want to do something that would make me even more uncomfortable in public? Yeah. 
Yeah, that's exactly what it is. I can wear anything in public if I'm confident and I think that I look cute. I do not look cute in this. I look... I think it looks good on, on camera. I think it looks great on camera. But we're in low lighting in my fucking bedroom with curtains over my windows, not outside or in a store with fluorescent light. Why am I still talking about this? I don't have to talk about this. Let's put some of this primer on and let's put some of this primer on and just continue while it's drying to have the crisis of do I or do I not want to deal with this? Because it's on the list of shit I just don't want to deal with right now. But what if I do it anyway? What if it turns out not as bad as I thought it was going to be? But also, I did cover like 75% of my face in it. Let's get this on and have a crisis while I do this. While I we're waiting for it to dry. Oh my god. I put way too much of this on. And I spaced out while I was doing it. It's actually dried down a little bit. It's actually dried down a little bit. It's actually dried down a little bit. I spaced out while I was putting it on because it smells like getting ready to go out on a Saturday night. The, the, the NYX, bear with me, it smells like getting ready to go out with your friends on a Saturday night. It smells like moments before disaster. And I was completely fucking spacing out and thinking about this while I was all over my face. I hope it doesn't piss off my skin. The last time that I used too much of this, my skin was not happy with me. It was very, very angry. Doesn't that make you have the Saturday Night Spice Girls song stuck in your head? The Get Down Deeper and Down song? Oh yeah! Oh yeah, I read something the other day and I can't remember what it was, but it made me have to listen to this Spice Girls song. It was like three words that were also strung together in a Spice Girls song. So I had to listen to said Spice Girls song on repeat for like three hours. Yeah, I just really love them still to this day. There's nothing like being a child and getting a brand new Spice Girls tape for your birthday. I remember how it smelled. I, I really, really do. Guys, do I want to do this? Instead of thinking about it, I was running my mouth about the Spice Girls and how much I fucking love them. Instead of like talking about it, talking my way through it, telling myself what I think you guys would say, I was thinking about the fucking Spice Girls because that's the story of my goddamn life. <laughs> oh my God, wish me luck. Oh my God. By the way, I'm making a short while I'm doing this. So if I look very stoic, that's why. I only had to dip that in there one time. Perhaps I just used too much last time. Uh, I quite literally only had to dip it in there one time and use like the smallest fucking amount. So what do I do with the rest of this? Waste it? Yeah, I'm gonna have to. <laughs> What do you think? It's not that bad. It's really not. It's really not that bad. It's not that bad. And not only that, it took like a pea sized fucking amount. Like quite literally, it did not hardly take anything. My lips are sticky as fuck from, <laughs> from the amount of fucking primer I put on. Oh my God. Did you see that coverage over, over my tattoos? What the fuck? You could quite literally, literally, take a spatula and just scrape off my face right now. It is so caked. She's caked. She's cakey caked. I'm fucking burning up. I think I'm gonna have to turn on my AC. Unfortunately, I think I'm gonna have to. I'm burning up and then my face is gonna melt. It's gonna melt before I even get the bitch all the way on. I might have to break down and do that as shit.
I'm feeling very yellow today. I'm feeling very much yellow eyeshadow today. And I'm really hoping that this Profusion palette has a yellow. Oh, thank God. I thought I was going to have to use the Redacted palette. The Redacted palette. It rhymes with Schmames Schmarls. <laughs> It's giving 2003 Gerard Way got punched in the face. Guys, I was really calm during that. My face looks yellow. Even with all that shit mixed in, my face looks yellow. I was calm during that. But I opened my bronzer and I saw this. Yeah. I'm afraid to put it in my makeup box because I feel like everything's just going to end up with bronzer on it. Oh, I'm so sad. It got all over my dress. Ugh. Ugh. Don't look. Don't look at that. I ate some hot dogs and I knew it would be bad, but I didn't know that it would be that bad. Can we look past the lipstick long enough for me to say bye? I gotta go because it's getting late and I have to edit my intro. And I'm very fucking tired today. And just get, look past, look past the lipstick, look past the fact that my uh, foundation has oxidized and my chest is red because I'm burning the fuck up. I'll see you guys tomorrow, boy.